scared. Uh, so today we're gonna make japa kechi. It's a Korean Chinese fusion of called jajimian black bean paste noodle. It's actually really good. Uh, you can buy this at your local grocery store, but we're not just gonna make it out of the packet. We're gonna spiceify it a bit with some sausage, some bell pepper, garlic, onion, and green onion. And, so, and also, we're gonna show you how to fry an egg properly. A lot of you guys still don't want to fry an egg, but it's a pretty easy trick. So, see three of us eating, so we're gonna need three bags. I'm sorry, I'm just kind of really hungry and uh, can't really control my level right now. So yeah, so, we'll do it on the boiling water. Don't forget, you have like three packets here that you don't want them to get mixed in with. Oh, another packet. We well, have two oil packets, okay. That's cool. Uh, so yeah, it's really good, very simple, easy to make. We're not going to use any of the water in here, just letting you know. Um, we're going to use the moisture of the oil to, to mix the black bean paste together. I know it's such a small pot to use all these. But oh well. Oh well. A lot quicker this way, it'll steam everything else. And if you like this video, uh, subscribe. And yeah. Watch your hand, get a bigger pot like I did. All you gotta do if you do a case like this, you just break the shit out of it. Don't burn yourself. Uh, tell me something I don't know. And we're so ghetto. We don't have anything to cover the heat, so I use the bottom of the plate. We do have a lid for that, you know. I can't find it. Oh, we don't forget about these, you know. Yeah, I need to get a crotch shot for me. Don't forget these too. Uh, these are the seasoning stuff. Actually, don't, don't look for it. Don't worry. I will do just fine. Oh, we do have it. Okay. Don't forget these things. The little dry vegetables. Doesn't need. Really... So that's time for it. So now we're going to cook our vegetables. The reason why I'm saying now is because I can't stand up for so long, so I'm not supposed to be cooking, so take that. So we're going to start warming up the heat. We're going to warm up this pan too for the uh, egg. Yeah, you're the only one that would eat egg. I don't like egg. Well, you need to find a new wife. So, we don't need that much oil. So we're just gonna spread this around. Let the pan heat up, oil heat up. Do the same thing with the egg one as well. You wanna find a, a saucepan that you have a lid for to fry your egg. I like mine sunny side up, but I'm gonna use a plate because I don't have a lid for this one actually, so. Because frying pans don't come with a lid. Well, actually, they eat some frying pans do. The bigger ones. Some. Yeah. But not the small ones. Small ones do too, so. Depends. This one did not. <sighs> he, he's obsessed with coffee. That's not coffee. What is that? Why don't you drink it? Chocolate milk? Seriously? Yeah. Are you going back to your childhood? Yes. I, I chop up some garlic, about four cloves of garlic, uh, half an onion, really finely because it actually doesn't like big chunks of onion, and bell pepper, and we have a, um, one uh, stalk of um, one Weber handful of green onion I chopped off too. Uh, the reason why uh, reason why I pick these type of vegetables, you can pick any type of vegetables you like. The reason why I pick these off because um, we don't want them to, the vegetables to go bad and go to waste. So that's why I'm going to softly cook it and um, hope and let it simmer down to so be nice and soft. Then we'll mix the noodles in here with this, with the black bean sauce. So I'm going to put some seasoning of pepper and some salt. You don't need too much salt because the packet is very salty. Just to let you know. So we'll let that simmer down and oops, a couple pieces fall down. So. So, we are going to put some sausage now. 
Uh, any small sausage or big sausage will come to pieces. Um, so yeah, this is why I learned how to make it in uh, Koreatown, LA. Kind of frozen a bit, but microwave will be doing fine. For 45 seconds, I think Bimo will try to get into the sausage. <laughs> yeah, it would be a Bimo. Yeah. She thinks sausage is yummy. Yeah. So I'm gonna mix that, let that thaw out and cook with the peppers, garlic, and onions. And here, we have a hot pan now. See how the oil switches around very easily now because the heat. So we're gonna crack an egg. Let that go around a bit. So that damn stove is cricket. I hate, I hate, I hate electric stoves. You want to put seasoning now before it fully cooks. One crack of salt. One crack of pepper because when it cooks, you don't have any surface tension that will stick to. So when that's cooking like that, the, the yolk and everything will start steaming and everything else. You want to put a plate over it for about a minute or two. And then you'll have nice white cooked yolk and nice runny little, uh, sorry, White yolk will be cooked, yellow yolk will be a little bit runny. That's what you want. And right now, we just got our cooked noodles. We're gonna strain it a bit of the water. Might be no water. I probably cooked it off like that. Down the side, we're gonna mix it with the noodles. And the sausage is done. Which is gonna be oil. Yeah, but we're gonna have See how, see how fast it's being cooked with the steam? Because people put water with the oil to make more steam. You can do it, but be careful because oil will splash on you. And it's very, oil and water don't mix. So very be careful with that. But I'm cooking one fried egg. Uh, it'll be perfect the way it is. Just gotta check it. So you don't overcook it. So, just letting you know. It should be done very quickly. So, yeah, if you guys want to learn, want to learn how to make lasagna from scratch, Ashley's meatloaf, stuff like that, let put put it down in the comment below. What do you want us to cook? And we'll cook it for it as well. We got the uh, we're trying out our new mint and basil water we just got from the garden. If you look at our vlogs, you see our uh, let's see some of these. Uh, we chopped it up, put it in the water. Let, you want to let it sit for a day and drink it. The reason why I'm doing this is it should be refreshing and also I need to drink a lot more water than freaking coffee every day. So yeah. So. I think it's about done. Yeah, it is. See? Stuff like that. White yolk's almost cooked. And yeah, it's done. There's your hot egg. You want to get it off the heat before it's fully cooked. My old McDonald's Hercules plate. It's cooked. Fried egg. Just like that. You put that off the heat. Put it in the sink. Don't put water on it. So we'll get back to you when we get to the... The sausage is actually done. It is not. Yeah, it's actually already pre-cooked and everything else. All you have to do is warm it up. Now we just got to add the noodles. A lot of fucking noodles. Uh, some of it got stuck in the bottom. Oh well, at least it's not burnt. Let that marry a bit with the stuff. You want to lower the heat for this. You want to get some moisture to stick the sauce and everything else within it. So we're going to get some oil, that is the key for it, and you can use your teeth, or your scissors, no one cares about my germs, put that down here, let me put this in the trash Ashley, watch out. Wrong side. We have 
three soybean packet, black soybean packets. We're gonna use for mix up. Ah. <laughs> It looks funny. See how my mom looks now with the dye? I already filmed her dying a bit. Then we're going to mix this up gently. For this, I'm going to use a scotch on. I'm going to use See how cheap we are? We don't we use rubber bands close to tongs. And start mixing it. Makes a lot, a lot easier, make it more uniform. Ooh, got mixed wrong a bit. The bottom the noodle should be all brown. Because using the soybean packet with the oil and water, and mixing it up. Remember, don't, you don't need any seasoning, only for the first time when you're cooking the vegetables, because there's a lot of salt content in this damn thing. So. So basically, you use whatever leftovers you can to make it. Yeah, I'm, both, I'm a messy cook. Don't worry, I have two lo lovely ladies that help clean up after me. <laughs> I will not. Yes, you will. For money, you would. It'll cost a thousand. Oh, no. It won't cost anything for you. So, yeah. So, see? See how brown it is? How uh, that's... Not because it's burnt, it's just black soybean sauce. But yeah, I don't know where Jajima originated from. I only can find Jajima in a Korean and Chinese fusion restaurants. Uh, if you want the actual uh, good ones, they're really good. I actually tried it over here in Sacramento and loved it. So, just done mixing. Then I'm going to put some green onion. They go mix with that. So, just get some color in there. And then I'm going to plate it. I like mine in a bowl, please. Uh, well, let me plate it and I'll make you for the bowl. Get some in there. Uh, it looks like shit. <laughs> Well, we got that. Not really a chef, but we'll see X Steve O. He's a chef by trade in the UK. Well, yeah. Get that. Right there, voila. There's your chapagetti. So, I hope you guys enjoy it, and let me know if you guys want more of it. Thank you guys for watching.